Today is a big, big day. FC25 news coming up. The Goliath of football gaming franchise is coming back with its next series. The news gaming website SGO came up with this news about FC25 and the future is looking good. This is an exclusive article right now and you find no news on the internet about this. And they start off by saying that we are still a few months away from the official reveal of EA Sports upcoming football title and EA Sports FC25. However, the sources have informed sports gaming online that there is a new feature coming to this game well if this is a surprise to you every year at this time there are big companies that approach EA sports and write articles about the upcoming game because if you think about it in just two months we'll have the first trailer of the game and there's not much time left for the game to be developed so the game is almost done probably at least in the earlier stages of the game it's almost done and as much as I know EA even if they don't improve the game according to you guys it's a big business for them and they will keep improving their game as much as they can and the biggest feature that we are getting on these articles and all the leaks is is the fc25 ai overhaul sources have told sports gamers online that ea sports fc25 will feature a complete ai overhaul the ai players will make more intelligent runs than previous titles and will adapt accordingly to different situations on the pitch so many fans complained about the ai's intelligence in defending in multiple modes this here. However, sources have confirmed that the computer players in pro clubs will be improved drastically. We all know how shit the bots are when it comes to pro clubs and pro clubs has not seen an overhaul since I don't know how many years. But if this is the year of AI, we will definitely see an improvement in the bot section. I hope so. EA, please don't be a scam. Another line from the article says that the AI will now read the danger from incoming counter attacks and adjust its defending tactics depending on the situation of the past events what this suggests is that AI will adapt the way we attack which is a new thing and has never happened before because before legendary used to just play as one legendary but now it can adapt to our playing style thus playing like a human more another segment in the article says with the inconsistent nature of AI players in previous games it's great to see that EA Sports is putting effort in improving this area of the game which is unpredictable and out of control of the players hands the problem is that the game will look exactly Exactly the same if the only thing that's put into consideration is the AI itself which then becomes fucking boring. FC25 according to me is going to be the make or break game. The game has been extremely boring. The deadest game out there was FC24. The game died in let's say March and the gameplay is not at all fun. The cutbacks and stuff were extremely boring and FIFA has been looking the same no matter how many years we can remember. But there is a light at the end of the tunnel. There is an account on Twitter called FootDonk who has leaked all of the stuff in the past and that was correct and he says there'll be a complete AI overhaul in this game more intelligent AI players and players remember past events making better tactical adjustments so basically a full AI overhaul AI is basically taking over the world and EA Sports is also adapting to that into the game if you have seen all this here there was no AI movement in the game all year youtubers have completely shouted on their videos saying that there is no AI movement in the game what? And thus EA Sports has responded back adding more AI movement which was there in previous titles like FIFA 16 or something. That's what it is. At least we have AI movement coming back in the game next year. To be honest, if you look at all the news, the focus this year is not making Mbappe sweat looking so realistic this year game. It's actually making better progress inside the gameplay which is I would say the most deadest part of the game these days. Like the gameplay has been the same for about 7 years which is boring. So AI improvement will help in that. Just talking about about the previous games FIFA 12 FIFA 11 they have all been arcades it was pure fun and nothing else but in the last few years when realism kicked in things have been super crap because realism causes so much randomness which then causes irritation and then the competitive nature is bullshit inside the game where it's all about fun well that's not just all the news in the article there is one more article published by real 101 sport where they say in the headline EA drop major hint for FC 20 who will it be which is I guess about the cover star and let's read through what it says okay so the EA senior marketing director Jane Salmon has hinted that a familiar face will be on FC 25's cover after explaining the strategy that goes into the selection process so they're not removing Haaland they also added saying that the current cover star Haaland represents the future of football and embodies what FC 24 looks like but then also there are new faces like Jude Bellingham that I would like to see on the cover because he is the main face 
face of football these days i guess and there you go in the article they say that someone like jude bellingham might become the cover star of fc 25 imagine imagine if fc 25 mbappe transfers to real madrid and holland and mbappe both are on the cover that'd be something like a cover of 2006 or something when ronaldinho and rooney were on the cover that's crazy my guess is going to be jude bellingham because he's getting all the glory these days he's english and fifa sells most in the uk then there is real madrid where all the glory is happening where he's celebrating with some awesome celebration and ruling over the internet but if you know who's going to be the cover star of fc 25 comment down below with a name well the other candidates could be haaland then there is vinicius junior he has a huge capability of getting onto the cover and many more options that i might not be thinking right now but you can tell me in the comment section below maybe kamavinga yeah he's everywhere possibly comment down below with a name and i'm going to pin your comment forever on this video now there's another news coming in fifa actually is not fifa anymore and is being linked to 2k who make a basketball game you know the nba 2k series it has been heavily rumored that the fifa 2k series might be a thing because 2k games is the direct competitor of ea when it comes to making sports games and they are the ones that are likely to buy the fifa license to create a football game of their own which is fifa 2k as of the rumors right now okay in a business article it was directly said that 2k wants to take over the whole sports simulation they already have a wwe game which is very popular then there is their nba series which you guys know is one of the biggest games out there then there is a tennis game that they just released which is awesome by the way so what is missing here definitely it's football and that's what they want to do this time i don't know about you but their nba games is something that i can never forget i've had such a great experience and their new tennis game is also awesome and they have missed out all of these years on the biggest sport in the world that's football and after the license separation of ea the sport is wide open to link with the 2k name and them releasing this game it is going to happen to be honest it has never been a better time when it comes to making a football game for 2k because ea are on a complete decline on sales their new game is not called fifa anymore so it's very easy for the 2k to link their name and get something out of it even though the news around this is barely nothing but the predicted launch of this game is expected to be around the world cup of 2k26 which could be the fifa 2k26 world cup game which is going to be an awesome launch and i would say i would happily want to try that game instead of ea's football game in that year because that world cup logo with 2k looks spicy to me and if something happens regarding that i will keep you updated on this channel so subscribe for more news on the latest upcoming games and you could also watch this video right here which also links about a free game that you can download right now and that is taking over the football world so check this video out right here